Uh, yeah, my parents thought I was, because uh, I was always on Xbox voice chat talking to people. They mm, thought yeah. uh, when I started voice acting, they were like, oh, Connor's just talking to his friends on Xbox. <laughs> So they didn't know what I was doing. He's just talking in funny voices. Why is, he saying, why is he saying the same thing over and over again? Huh? Doing different inflections. That's really fucking weird. Oh, never mind. He's probably playing Xbox. Connor's a weird one. <laughs> Got some weird hobbies, right? Yeah. yeah. yeah I mean, my, I think my parents definitely, when I was a kid, they saw me as like the weird kid of the like of like the four. Right. They were like, hey, he's the strange one, but normally things work out in the end. <laughs> He'll it. find his way. Yeah, that's normally the way, the way that it was. I mean, I like. Growing up, I, I do sometimes I do wish that I did have brothers and sisters. Um, Cause I feel I I don't know I don't know I don't know how you guys feel about your siblings, but I feel like there's nothing. I wouldn't that can... want to be raised without brothers or sisters. Mm. I think now that I've had them, I just couldn't imagine not being raised with siblings. Yeah, yeah. same. I don't know. Yeah, I, I I can't imagine just having to share everything though. That's well, you don't well, have to. <laughs> that's why. That's why how you learn to lie. Right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Although I did have to share my Xbox and that was horrible. We'd have to like swap every hour. And I'm like, I can't even get a good gaming session in here for now. Are you kidding me? I mean, that's why I'm glad like the first like game console we got was Game Boy Advances. Cause we had one each. That was the first Game Boy, that was the first Privilege. console you got? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or any like, yeah. Well, like any console that we could actually share, right? Or wasn't like a two player thing. Cause we had like the N64 and stuff like that too. But yeah, if yeah. you have two controllers, you can play together. Yeah. Yeah. But can't quite do that on a on a handheld console, right? True, true. So it was it was fucking fun. Like you know, sometimes I'd want to get on the N sixty four, play a one player game, yeah. like fucking Donkey Kong sixty four or Super Mario yeah. sixty four or something. Yeah. You can't play that with my sister. Yeah. So I'm just like, fuck. What do we do? We'll just get a handheld console and just play whatever the fuck games we want together. Problem solved. Man, I miss being fucking stupid as a kid. I'm, I do because <laughs> I, I I miss. I, I had this thought the other day. I miss how simple it was just to like find happiness in something. Right. So my first Get game- real deep here. So my first game console or game device was a yeah. Game Boy Color. Okay. Right. And my parents bought it for me in France. And um, yeah. they were like, well, what game do you want? I'm like, Pokemon. Mm. Yeah. I didn't know it at the time. Yeah. So it turns out the game was in French, obviously through in France, <laughs> yeah. um, but somehow still managed to complete the whole thing. Wow. When I was like eight or something. And I'm like, I would not have the patience to fucking do that now. No, no. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what the fuck was going on. I don't know what any of the moves did, but I think like eight-year-old me had just understood that this set of letters did this funny thing that did a lot of damage because right, right, I had yeah, just yeah. been playing it so much. Yeah, yeah. So I think yeah. by the time I got to the Elite Four, I think nearly all my Pokemon were level 100. Oh my God. It was literally like just trial by fire, right? It was literally just grinding. And I'm like, how the fuck did I do that? I'm so dumb. I wish being that dumb where I could just throw myself at something like that. Yeah, uh, like I remember cause I also, I mean, I got the Game Boy Advance, but the yeah. first couple of games I got were Game Boy Color games. Yeah. Because yeah. you could play the Game Boy Color games on, in yeah, the Game Boy yeah, Advance, yeah. which yeah. I was like, oh my God, technology. Yeah. But um, yeah, I remember like I, <laughs> the part where I think about it now, where it's like, I definitely had too much time as a kid that mm. I could not sink into my adulthood was yeah. when I managed to, on my Pokemon Sapphire cartridge, I played it so much that I maxed out the in time clock. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah. Like what? I found out that on Pokemon Sapphire on Game Boy Advance. Is it 1000 hours? Or? Yeah, 999 hours and 99 minutes is the furthest it will go. Did you just <laughs> leave this thing on 24 seven? No, that's how much I played it. I like, see it, man. When you're a kid, man. you just get obsessed. Like every yeah. moment, because especially the Game Boy Advance, like looking back on it now, this thing's fucking tiny. Yeah. Like you could put that in like jeans pocket no. or like a jacket pocket, you take it everywhere. The best one, because I think it was literally when we were kids, was the Game Boy uh, Advance SP. Oh, the SP. Oh, oh that SP. was so only the, good. Only the cool rich kids yeah. had that one. Bro, the SP was like the best one, because that shit like just, it would literally fit in your like, your tiny child jeans. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It was amazing. I, uh, fucking I, I remember, I remember one of my Japanese friends brought it to school yeah. once, mm -hmm. and he was like, boys, <laughs> check, <laughs> check this out. Yeah. <laughs> it was like, whoa. And and it was like, and it's got a backlight on it. It was like, oh! that was you can play that oh, yeah. the backlight. Yeah. I completely the forgot SP that was, was the first one that thing. had a backlight. And before yeah. then you had to attach like those like fucking the, the reading fucking, lamps. The fucking reading lights that had the <laughs> awful glare. Well, I think actually the first model of the SP didn't have a backlight. It was like the second model. Oh really? Which is the more popular model, I think. Yeah, 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 yeah. But uh, I, I had an SP and I got one cause uh, my friend got one and I saw him playing it. And for like Christmas, I was like, mom, I want nothing more than the Game Boy Advance SP. <laughs> and you know what game I played the most on it? Oh, the fucking GBA game. <laughs> I played Pokemon trading card game. <laughs> oh. Have you played that game on Game yeah, Boy? Yeah, yeah. It's so good. It's fun, anyway. right? Yeah, I mean, I, I remember like, oh, go, go, oh, go sorry. ahead. Sorry, I, I had a fi finalization to the story. 
Uh, one time I thought, you know, I was so addicted to this thing, right? I would literally walk around the house with it. I would sleep with it. Oh right? yeah, yeah, of I course. Would, like, I, of course. You know, yeah. If I was walking down the stairs, I would play Game Boy walking down the yeah, stairs. Yeah, yeah, if yeah, I was yeah. at the dinner table, I'd be there. If I was going to bed, I'd play it. Yeah. I would even, if I went to pee, I would, I would play with it. Okay. So I would pee with it. One time I dropped it down the toilet. No! <laughs> Not sure how it happened. I was playing I was playing Pokemon trading card game because that was the cartridge that was in there. Yeah. Yeah. I was playing it while I was peeing. You know, you know you're like 12, you've yeah. you know, little dicks out, you're like, yeah. all right, cool. All right, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I don't know how I dropped it. I dropped it and I was like, how do I explain this to my mom? <laughs> how do I tell that I don't have a Game Boy SP <laughs> anymore? <laughs> and uh, yeah, it didn't work. And Did you lie? No, because <laughs> it smelled of piss as well. <laughs> yeah. I, I for some reason I checked if the uh, if Pokemon trading card game still worked. Still worked, of course. But, of course. So I plugged it into my uh, the old Game Boy car I had. Yeah, yeah. But uh, yeah, so I had to go to my mom. I was like, Mom, um, so this is kind of like embarrassing, but. Uh, I dropped my Game Boy down the toilet. And she was like, how did you drop your Game Boy down the fucking toilet? And I'm like, I don't, I don't know. I just, you know, I just really enjoy playing it. And my family fucking rinsed me for like five years. Well, yeah, if that was my yeah. kid, I'd fucking rinse him yeah, too. Do you, know, do you know how expensive a Game Boy yeah, Advance SP is they, at that age? Yeah, but yeah. They, they loved it purely for the comedic purposes. Every time we'd meet someone, they're like, this is Callum. He's he's very successful, very smart. This is Connor. He dropped his Game Boy down the fucking <laughs> toilet. <laughs> and I was so sad for like four months. I was literally every window. I was like, <laughs> what it's, do I do? Did, like, you, did you ever get another one? I did six months later for my birthday. I was like, wow, really? I, yeah, I'd yeah. Wait, I'd like literally, I remember like for six months, I was like playing Game Boy Color again. Yeah. yeah. Just playing Pokemon trading card game with other shitty Game Boy. Your parents game. are yeah. nice, man. If, if if I did that, my parents would never buy me a game cartridge. Again. I think they felt so bad for me because of how like distraught I was. And I think they thought I was going to get over it, but I, I was sad for like half a year. Well, yeah, it's yeah. like dropping like a fuck. That. It's like yeah. dropping a yeah. laptop down yeah, the toilet. Yeah, yeah. I was like, I could not get over it. And I yeah. think my parents, at some point we're like, all right, I think we should get him another one. Or maybe he's like not gonna recover. <laughs> maybe he's never gonna let this go. And I wouldn't have, I wouldn't have let this go. 